No one deployed the use of macros in this study, something that we'd find in Excel spreadsheets and other applications. These were very helpful, especially as we got into the whole segment of data harmonization. Yes, the main macro that was used was in the, um, the formatting of the data. Uh, when we first pulled in the actual webinar data itself. Let me pull up that particular document. Um, this was the one that we had shown a little bit earlier, but what this allowed us to do is to add consistent metadata to the file. So we would make sure that when we collected the data um, inside the file itself, it would tell us the date that the survey was um, conducted. And we would enter that data in a consistent format into this macro. And then by running it, it would copy that data on each one of the individual rows as we pivoted the data so we had consistency in our data. This allowed us to have a consistent data source that we could then use downstream as we were consolidating questions and looking at uh, the different responses to the surveys.